Burgers with Buck continues to celebrate Explore Gwinnett's Burgers and Brews Week, but sadly, it comes to an end tomorrow. The good news, though, you've still got two more days to enjoy delicious $7 burgers at 12 Gwinnett County restaurants. You know, like the Pretzel Burger and Three Blind Mice in Lilburn. This week, Burgers with Buck, we are in Gwinnett County. We're in Lilburn. We are at Three Blind Mice. I love the name. Let me introduce you to Matthew. First of all, Matthew, it's a cool name. It's unique. Tell me how you guys came up with it. Well, we came up about it eight years ago or so. I was looking for something that was unique, catchy, easily remember mm -hmm. remembered. And uh, we initially started with three business partners. And I wanted to use some form of that. Uh, mostly that I wanted to have a name that people could easily remember. I found that um, there was no other restaurants named that. So I, I found some that stuck. I think it worked. I don't think people are going to forget. So it's uh, Burgers and Brews Week in sure. Gwinnett. You guys have a burger you feature every week. Tell me about Burgers with Brews Week and, the, and why you guys are participating in it. Absolutely. This year, um, it runs from this past Sunday, a couple days ago, through Saturday. Um, we're serving this burger at nighttime from 5 to close. Mm -hmm. And it is the pretzel burger. So it's $7. It is sold a la carte, just the burger. You can order um, side of french fries or other items from our menu. And this burger is um, done on a pretzel, toasted pretzel bun. Um, Creature Comforts Bebo Pilsner uh, Beer Cheese. So it literally is um, grated cheddar um, beer, in this case, Creature Comforts Pilsner, mm -hmm. um, cornstarch, salt, pepper, a little bit of Coleman's dry mustard powder. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of a wet fluid cheese, but it's got a lot of flavor and earthiness. So listen, you had me a pretzel burger, okay? Yeah. Uh, let's talk about the burger itself. I mean, sure. it's a week celebrating burgers in Gwinnett County. Burgers, it's not just what used to happen in the backyard anymore. They, they come a long way. Burgers are such a specialty item now. They have. Um, it seems that uh, Americans, but at least in Georgia, are crazy about burgers. We actually didn't sell a burger for our first couple of years and eventually bowed to the pressure. People kept on asking, so we put it on and we sell an awful lot of burgers during the week. I love talking about burgers. There's only one thing I like more than them that's tasting them. I think, okay. it, I think I'm ready to give the uh, the pretzel burger from Free Blind Mice a try. Absolutely. Got my napkin. It should be ready to go here. I'm going to turn the plate just a little bit. A lot of cheese. You know, I haven't ruined a shirt yet, Matthew. Uh, you're going to need a napkin for this one. Okay, here we go. The pretzel burger, three blind mice in Lilburn. Take it away, Matthew. All right, well, thank you for coming in and uh, showcasing what we're doing, as well as giving us a little bit of publicity. Again, Three Blind Mice up in Lilburn, not too far away. We're about five miles from Stone Mountain Park, just up 78. You probably should go climb Stone Mountain a time or two after you eat that, just to be <laughs> safe, too. The Three Blind Mice, certainly not a restaurant that you would describe as a burger joint, but the burgers they do, they do well. And for more info on Three Blind Mice and the waning hours of Burgers and Brews Week, go to the Scene on Good Day section of the Fox 5 Atlanta app. And you